Welcome back, got another quick battery test today. I bought a couple of Samsung 35E18650 cells, trying to see if I can find a battery that's the highest capacity in unprotected cells. So this is the spec, it's worth looking at. We have a maximum and continuous discharge of eight amps, and also take note of the charging speed. So to preserve the battery condition, you wanna charge these at around about an amp and not any higher. They'll take a higher charge, but you'll get reduced cycle times if you do. Now comparing it to the L LG MJ1 which I also recently tested. I'm hoping to see if these can get closer to the 3500 milliamps um, because the MJ1s were a touch under that and the discharge test that I got on these both of them exceeded the 3500 that's a half an amp discharge. So based on this test I would have to say these are probably a slightly better bet than the MJ1s if you need that extra bit of capacity. Not quite as uh, high drain as the LG cells, but for most applications for either torches or possibly vaping, these would do the job quite nicely. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.